also this Volo case with her and her missing kids. It's getting stranger and stranger. So, rumor has it that she is part of a cult. So is her husband or her boyfriend or whatever he is to her. And not only that, she said that this is rumor. This has not been confirmed. She said that the kids were zombies. And by zombies, what she means is that they are soulless. And this is just rumor. Again, this is not confirmed. She actually said this. She said that... And I want to know if, if, if she believes this. She said the kids were soulless. That they had no souls. That basically they were just empty vessels. So they were zombies. So let's see. Is that something she believes? Or no? So there's the King of Cups. First card crossed by King of Pentacle. Two men. The Nine of Pentacle. Queen of Swords. Six of Cups. There's the kids around security money. Self reliance and the tower is around her. Interesting. The Star. King of Swords. The Magician. There's seven people here. The Knight of Swords. You have one, two, three, four, five, six people. Well, seven kids, kids, but six people. So this is a group of some sort, possibly, yes, a cult. But um, does she believe it? Is what I'm asking. Um, I'm not getting yes or no, but I'm thinking. Okay, so here's here's what we do have. We have two people here. What should we have? Let's just take them all out. So you have the magician, the knight of swords, king of swords, king of pentacles, king of cups, and then one woman. You have five men, one woman. Then you have the kids, the tower, the nine of pentacles, and the star. Why is the star here? Ten of wands. So there is, I'm going to say yes, even though it's not saying yes or no. Here's why I'm saying yes. You have so many people here. One of them is the magician. This is the ultimate manipulator. But even with that aside, if you have this many people involved in this one situation, there is no way whatsoever. Well, there's no way I believe whatsoever that this is not something she believes or at the very least something she has gone along with or adopted. Simply because majority usually wins in these in particular cases, especially of peer pressure, public pressure, whatever kind of pressure it is. Because here with the star and the ten of wands, there is pressure for future. There is there is pressure around the things she believes. There is pressure around the things that are happening or is going to happen. There is pressure here upon the woman, the female energy here with the star. There is a security here or the nine of pentacles. There is something to do with a group. There is something to do with security. The ten of or the tower and the six of cups. Well, the tower is around her, which means she had a loss. And then the Six of Cups was around the security. So that was her home. That was her life. There was supposed to be, you know, everything she's supposed to live for. But here with the group, there's five other guys here. There's no way that she did not adopt their thinking. And she's at the center of this. There's no way your kids go missing and you go to Hawaii and go partying. So there, okay, here's, here's another question. 
how did I say that? So someone convince you your kids are zombies. Soulless vessels. I believe there was a transaction. And somebody in that group knows more than they're letting on, right? Why did you go to Hawaii? Because you thought things were done, trying to get your mind off of things. Were all these people involved in this? Like, why did you go to Hawaii? Your kids are missing. And then you skip down. Why? Why, oh why? Magician, first card. And death. Eight of pentacles. Eight of wands. There's the tower again. Ace of swords. Moon, Nine of Swords, Six of Swords, Three of Wands. That's what I thought the first time. Actually, I said it a long time ago, but I said it in jest to where, you know, you just lost your kids because you paid somebody to allegedly kill them and then you went and took your mind off of things. But that's what it looks like. It really is what it looks like. So you have the Magician, the Manipulator, surrounded by the Death card. And then you have the Tower, and then the Eight of Pentacles, something that you do from day to day, something that is, you needed a break from the day to day. Like you needed, you needed some sort of travel for clarity from the Clarit Mine with the Nine of Swords. You need it to get your mind off of things because there's a six of swords. There's your transition into a better time. And then the three of wands. The three of wands is, is preparations for completion. So to get your mind off of things. So we got one more question. To get your mind off of what? To get your mind off of what? King of Pentacle. Three of Pentacle. Eight of Cups. Six of Cups. There's your kids again. And seven of Cups. So, your day-to-day -day life your abandonment um, cloudy thinking and three of pentacles here the alliance around the kids and then whoever this king of pentacles is in the middle so oh lord <laughs> you were Trying to get your mind off of the fact that you know exactly what happened to your kids. The law will judge your actions. The Lord will judge your soul. Be prepared for both. 